Unit 10, all about the money, saving and investing. As you can see, there are going to be two grades in this unit. The first one is this all about the money um, homework assignment, which has you completing four different lessons on this website called EverFi. That is worth 20 points. And you'll notice all the way down at the end of this unit, we will have a big quiz over this all about the money unit and that will be worth 28 points. To get started, let's look at this EverFi homework assignment. I'm gonna show you how to do this. So EverFi is a website that brings real world, world learning to the classroom. We're gonna work through a unit on EverFi called FutureSmart. Now FutureSmart is gonna teach you about how to effectively set goals with your money, prepare for your careers, manage your financial future, through some interactive scenarios that put you in real life situations. Think of this like the learning.com lessons we did earlier, except this time we're only dealing with money. You're gonna notice in EverFi that you need to complete the first four lessons. You can see in this picture, once we log in, there's seven lessons, but I'm only wanting you to focus on the first four. They're each worth five points each. You wanna get a green check mark on each one, because each green check mark is worth five points for a total of 20 points, as you can see down here, for this entire unit. So let me show you what you do. First, we're going to click on this link to log into Clever. Many of you already have a link to Clever on your Chromebooks. I click on this, and you're going to log in with your school Google account. When you get into Clever, I want you to go to D. Dean's teacher page. You can see my name right here. Let's click it. And finally, you're just going to click on EverFi. When this loads up, you may get a privacy policy update. It pops up every time. Just hit close and you're ready to click start. Once you start, it's going to say you were being directed to a survey. I have chosen not to make you do the survey, so you can just click to continue and you're going to be on the first screen. Notice that you only have to do number one, welcome mayor, number two, smart shopping, number three, ways to pay, and number four, investing in you. And all you're going to do is click start on this and you're going to see that this person talks to you. They're going to ask you questions. You're going to have to answer questions. Some of these have little quizzes and you would just hit next. You read it's, it. If you use your earbuds, it will talk to you and tell you what you need to do. And you can see right on the bat in this course, you're going to be challenged to encourage to not only think about what's important to you today, but think about your future. So what they want you to do is find what matters to you, select three things and you just start going through this lesson. Like say I like, you know, having a job that I love. I would like to, you know, get a good education. And I would like to, you know, own a house someday. And then you click submit. And all you're going to do is keep working through this lesson one by one. You can always go up here and click these three dots, these three lines in the corner. They will take you back to your main menu. You can see that now you can continue and it will probably take you back a few uh, pages where you'll have to continue what you did, but it does save your work as you go. So what you're going to do is you're going to continue to work only on lesson one, lesson two, lesson three, and lesson four. So once you've completed all four lessons and you have a green check mark on each one, that means you will get the full 20 out of 20 points, that you will get five points for each green check mark. Here's five points, 10 points, 15 points, and 20 points. And you can go up here and click on the three lines. And if you go to scores, it will show you what your little quiz grade because lesson two, lesson three, and lesson four, they give you a quiz at the end, and that's how it gives you a grade. You must have a 70% or higher 
if you do not have a 70% or higher, you will not get a green check mark and you will have a red X. And I'll show you what you do if you do have a red X. If you finish the first four lessons and you notice that any of these four lessons have a red X like right here where it says investing in you, you can just simply click on the lesson and if you choose retake, it will ask you the 10 question quiz again. You can take this quiz as many times as you want until you get a 70% so you get the full five points. Another way is to go up here on the three lines in the corner, click on scores, and you can see that this one was a 60%. You can click retake and just take the quiz. If you go and to your main menu and you choose replay, it'll make you do the entire lesson from scratch. So I know most of you probably don't want to go through the entire lesson. So just click the three dots, go to the main menu, choose retake instead of replay. And once that your score is above a 70%, you'll get a green check mark and you'll get the full five points for that lesson. So in conclusion, remember, you want to make sure that you have a 70% on lesson two, lesson three, and lesson four. Lesson one, Welcome Mayor, does not give you a quiz. Once you finish it, you will automatically get the five points. This is worth a total of 20 points. And once you're finished with these, you'll get the full grade.